What is going on with my hair? <laughs> like, what is this piece? Does anyone else have this? I have this annoying piece that's like here that wants to go this way but belongs this way. What is that? What are you? <laughs> Got it. <laughs> I don't even know where to put it. Okay. Please excuse my weird baby hair. <laughs> Hiya! I've been tagged by the lovely Charlotte from Lurch Hand Loves to do the TMI tag. So that is the video that I'm going to do today. I have the questions on my phone. I haven't looked through them first. So I'm just going to say the first thing that comes into my head. So hopefully that's alright. Uh, but yeah, let's get started. And please excuse my really like, bad nails. <laughs> I really need to paint my nails. And they look really horrible at the moment. But So please excuse that. Question one, what are you wearing? I've got this like grey, it's black and white, the actual fabric, but it looks grey, um, turtleneck dress from River Island on, and it's long sleeves, and then I've got some wet look Topshop leggings on, and a necklace from River Island. Question two, have you ever been in love? Um, I hope so with my boyfriend right now, Luke. Um, if I'm not in love with him, then I don't know why I'm still here, but yeah, just once. Ever had a terrible breakup? Um, yes, <laughs> I, don't, I don't know how much detail I want to go into this, um, me and Luke didn't have a great first year, our friends know that, um, but we're back together after our first year, we've been together like five-ish years now, so it's all fine now, but yeah, that was my terrible breakup. Question four, how tall are you? I think I'm about five foot four, roughly, I can't be precise, but I think roughly five foot four. How much do you weigh? Now, we don't have scales in our house because... Uh, I think my mum threw them out because she didn't like them. <laughs> um, so I don't actually know how much I weigh, but when I go to the doctors, I weigh around like 48, 50 kilograms, roughly. So whatever that works out as in stones and pounds, I don't know. But yeah, I pretty much stay around 48 to 50 kilograms all the time. But I don't know how much I weigh right now because we don't own scales in our house. Any tattoos? No, I don't have any tattoos. I did want a tattoo to do with my dad, but then I kind of went off the idea. I don't know if I'll ever get any, but at the moment, no. Any piercings? I've only got my just like single ear piercings. When I was, I think, 15, I got the double like ear piercings, but they got really infected, so I took them out. So I haven't had the bravery to get any more piercings. I kind of wanted my nose done at one point but then I decided that I didn't like the idea of it getting infected and stuff like that but other than that, other than these like one earrings, no I don't have any piercings. Question 8, OTP. So I, I double checked because I wasn't sure but this means one true pairing I think so if that's wrong then I'm sorry but I think it means it's on my computer now and it says one true pairing meaning your favourite combination of characters in a fandom. So I don't really know what people answer to this question, but if it's like characters that you're obsessed with in like a fictional world, um, then I would pick Hayley and Nathan from One Tree Hill. They're my favourite two, like people that are in love ever. I don't know if that even answers the question because I don't really understand the question. But yeah, hopefully. <laughs> I don't know. Is that right? Is that wrong? Let me know. Favourite show? I, oh, I don't know. Is this ever or... Right now. Right now, I would say The Walking Dead. Ever, I would say... Ever, I would either say One Tree Hill or The Vampire Diaries. Question 10. Favourite bands? Do I like any bands? I feel like I need to go on my Spotify to see what I've been listening to. So, for favourite bands, I've checked on my iTunes and then two recent albums that have been added are Busted and One Direction. So, I'm going to go with them for favourite bands of the moment. Question 11, something you miss, uni. I would go back to uni in a heartbeat. I miss uni so, so much. At the time, I complained a lot, but looking back, I would do anything to be back at uni. Question 12, my favorite song. I don't think I could pick a favorite song ever. At the moment, I would probably pick, I don't know. Probably one of my favorites at the moment is Taylor Swift, Blank Space. I love that song, so that's my favorite song of the moment. Question 13, how old are you? I am 23. Question 14, zodiac sign, I am a Gemini. Question 15, quality you look for in a partner. Um, I don't know if you have to pick one. Um, I'm gonna say humor 
and caring. Yeah, they gotta be funny and they gotta be nice. <laughs> Question 16, favourite quote? Do I have a favourite quote? I don't know if I have any like really famous quotes. The only thing that I can think of is a Disney one and that's from Bambi. If you can't say nothing nice, don't say nothing at all because it's pretty true. So I'm gonna go with that because it's Disney so it's gotta be great. Question 17, favourite actor? If it's a man, then John Travolta. I absolutely adore John Travolta. And if it's a woman, I'm a big fan of Cameron Diaz. I love everything that she's in. Question 18, favourite colour? I love purple. Um, at one point my room had purple floor, it still has purple floor, purple walls, everything which is purple because I'm a big fan of purple. Question 19, loud music or soft? So I don't know how to describe what I'm talking about very easily, but I don't like slow ballads that are all like lovey-dovey. I like music that makes me feel happy and like woo! So <laughs> anything that makes me feel like that, then that. So it doesn't have to be really loud, it just has to be happy. Question 20, where do you go when you're sad? I come and sit in my room and <laughs> lie in my bed because it's the best place ever. <laughs> Question 21, how long does it take you to shower? It depends, if I'm just washing my hair and my body, then I can be showered in like five minutes. If I'm like shaving my legs and all that kind of girl stuff, then probably like 15 minutes. Question 22, how long does it take you to get ready in the morning? Um, I don't really know. If I'm getting ready for like a nice day and doing stuff or whatever, then I don't know. Cause it's like separate time scales, isn't it? Because, oh God, I don't know if I ramble on, but I, so if I shower it takes me 15 minutes then I'd probably say like if I'm getting ready for something nice like probably about an hour and a half if I'm getting ready for work then I can be done in like half an hour Question 23 Ever been in a physical fight? I'm ashamed to say yes it was with my best friend in year 11 so we were like 15, 16 and it was in the classroom uh, just as lunch was ending which wasn't great in front of everyone so yeah um, that's the only fight I've ever been in though Question 24, turn on. I don't know. Like when someone's funny. Uh, question 25, turn off. Um, when someone's really rude and just moody all the time, I like people to be happy. Question 26, the reason I joined YouTube. Because I thought it looked like fun. I saw other people making videos and I just thought it looked like it'd be really, really fun. And I'm kind of... I don't know, being an only child I sort of did a lot of stuff on my own so this kind of came like quite normal to me. I didn't think it was weird sitting down talking to a camera. Um, I'd made videos like this when I was younger by myself anyway and just spoken to the camera. So yeah, I just thought it looked like a bit of fun and yeah. Question 27, fears. What am I afraid of? I don't know if it means like big life fears or just general fears. General fears, spiders, dark that kind of stuff. Like last night there was a spider outside my room and I just started screaming for Luke to come get it. Uh, general life, no, like big life fears. Um, just, I don't know, not really achieving anything in my life. I just want to see the world a bit and feel like I've done some good in my life. That's really, really deep. I think I got a bit too deep with that question. Question 28, last thing that made you cry? Um, I think it was the season 6 finale of Sons of Anarchy which I watched last week. I mean, I was sitting there thinking, oh god no! If you haven't seen it then you won't know what I'm talking about, but if people haven't seen it and want to watch it, I'm not going to spoil it, but it was just, oh my god. So, yeah. Question 29, last time you said you loved someone, I told Luke I loved him as he left my house about an hour ago. Question 30, meaning behind your YouTube name? Um, I wanted my YouTube channel to be called Robin Caitlin, like my blog is, but when I was trying to get that URL, it was like, no, you can't have that, and it had a list of like suggested things to add on the end, and Abel, or Abel, is on the end, so I thought it would sound like Robin caitlin of all. So not, like, it's not like Robin caitlin Abel, it's like Robin caitlin of all. I don't know if that makes any sense, but that was the only option in the list that made kind of sense. So, if you're wondering how to say my channel name, it is Robin Caitlin Abel, not Robin Caitlin Abel, because that sounds weird. Anyway, question 31, last book you read. So, I've got a couple of 
answers to this because on my Kindle the last book that I fully read was Tasmania Perry Deep Blue Sea so I think that I read that on holiday in, back in October and then a more recent thing that I read, I haven't read the whole of it but I read a bit and it is from this book A Merry Christmas and Other Christmas Stories by Louisa May Alcott and it was like a oh it's got some mark on it <laughs> um, it was from I saw it in Waterstones over Christmas and um, just thought it looked really nice like the cover and everything and it's a set so I got two of the others from the set I think it's a set of five uh, but yeah it's just a nice little Christmas story so I read a bit of that book question 32 the book you're currently reading currently I'm reading Cabin Fever The Sizzling Secrets of a Virgin Air Hostess so it's like truth but I don't know I don't know if it's partly made up or what but um yeah it's really good I think I'm about halfway through it right now but it's really really good question 33 the last show that you watched the last thing I watched on TV was Top Gear that wasn't my choice it was just on so I watched it uh, I don't hate Top Gear I just don't I wouldn't choose to watch it question 34 the last person you talked to I spoke to my mum and I went I'm filming a video so I'm going upstairs Question 35, the relationship between you and the person you last texted. The person I texted last was Luke and that is my boyfriend. Question 36, favourite food? Lasagna. <laughs> that was literally like the quickest I've ever just decided something. Yeah, I'm a massive fan of lasagna. Question 37, a place you want to visit? Um, I'd really like to visit New Zealand because everyone that I know that's been there has raved about it so I feel like I'm missing out and I really need to go to New Zealand. Question 38, last place you were, um, I was over at my mum's partner's house which is like half an hour away from where I live. Question 39, do you have a crush? Well I have a boyfriend so I can't really have a crush. But I'll go for a celebrity crush and that is Channing Tatum because he's an absolute babe. Question 40, last time you kissed someone, about an hour ago when Luke left the house. Question 41, last time you were insulted, about an hour ago before Luke left, he called me a shitbag. Not, <laughs> not in a horrible way, just in a jokey way. Question 42, favourite flavour of sweet? Um, I quite like rhubarb and custards. Question 43, what instruments do you play? I don't play anything. I didn't. I don't even play the bloody recorder. I mean, everyone played the recorder apart from me, I feel like. I don't play any instruments. I always just like, sort of thought I'd want to play like, the guitar or something can be really like, I don't know, cool and play the guitar. So hopefully in my life I will learn to play an instrument at some point, but right now I don't play anything because I'm useless. Question 44, favourite piece of jewellery? My favourite piece of jewellery is, it won't focus if I put it close so I can't really show you easily, but it is this silver ring that Luke bought me for my 21st when we were in New York and it's just a plain like silver band from Tiffany and so on the outside it just says T and Co and then on the inside Luke got it engraved and it just says the date of my 21st, L for Luke and a kiss, so yeah nice little sentimental piece of jewellery. Question 45, last sport you played? I don't play sport so I just like a fail at life. I don't play instruments, I don't play sport. I just didn't really do much <laughs> as a kid clearly. I don't do anything. Question 46, last song you sang? Yesterday in the car I got really really like up in Luke's face singing Bon Jovi always. Question 47, favourite chat up line? I don't have a favourite chat up line because I don't like chat up lines, but one that I keep hearing is that boyfriend material, you know, when you like feel the clothes and it's like, what's that? It feels like boyfriend material. It was on Take Me Out and it's been at work and I just, <laughs> chat up line is just the worst. So question 48, have you ever used it? No, because chat up lines are the worst. Question 49, last time you hung out with anyone? Well, me and Luke were hanging out yesterday watching TV so I'll say that. Question 50, who should answer these questions next? So if these people haven't already done it I'm going to tag Melody from A Simple Melody, Sophie from Sophie's Choices and finally Ali from Ali in Blunderland. I think that's how you say it. I'm sorry if anyone's names I've said wrong or anything like that but those are three people I tag. So thank you again to Charlotte from Lurch and Loves for tagging me to do this video. So I hope you've enjoyed it. A few little 
insights into my life so I don't know if you need any but just in case you did uh, but yeah thank you for watching if you're not already subscribed to my channel then if you subscribe that would be amazing if you are already subscribed then thank you very much and hopefully I'll see you in my next video